In this video, I will show you how to take your client from this to this within eight oh, minutes. Man. So to get started, the first thing I'm going to do is comb out the hairline. As you can see, my guy definitely has multiple cowlick. So we're going to fix that right now. So I did cut the whole head to a two close. So right now I'm cutting over the, um, the hairline with the two close on the dark areas and not where that cowlick is. Now this is the part where you get that hairline low without messing up the cowlicks. I'm using my two open on the hairline just blending in the end just blending in the lineup area into the waves you know because we need the lineup area lower than the rest that way when you brush his hair lineup is still crispy and it'll last longer than the rest of the haircut so as you do that too open you do go back with the two clothes on the lineup um just to kind of blend it in i'm using my corners here and there um doing what i need to do to get that bulk out and blend blend it into the rest of the hair Right now I'm using my hairspray, my Tresemme 5 Hold, that is the brand that I use. So everybody that always asks me what hairspray do I use, it is Tresemme. Okay, you can get it from Walmart, and it is the 5 Hold. It's the Max Hold. It's the best one that I use for me. I tried 4, I tried 3, I tried Gotta Be Glued. I've tried other hairspray brands. I don't like it, okay? This is the one I use, this is the one I like, and I'm going to continue to use it. So right now I'm blow drying the hair while combing the hair down just to get it to lay down. Um, it is natural place right now we're just gonna cut all that overhang off because my guy is a waver he's always uh, brushing his hair down so all that little hair down there you won't need that my guy has really thin edges too so we're gonna get that real locked in for him we'll get to get an enhanced now the enhancement does last three to five days and it is waterproof shout out to 245 but we trying to get this haircut crispy as possible without enhancements now it's time for the enhancements i'm using the corded compressor off amazon you guys can look it up um all, most of them are pretty much the same some are better than others but it's trial and error you gotta try them out for yourself so right now i'm just applying the enhancement making everything dark and even as possible Covered up them thin edges, and we're gonna uh, spray in that cowlick, you know, because why not? You know what I'm saying? It's nothing he could do about it, no matter how you cut it down, no matter if you try to cut away from it, um, it's just always gonna stand out like that because that's just how his hair grows and he brushes over it, so there's nothing you can really do. As a barber, you want them to be crispy as possible when they get out your chair. So you're just gonna do, you're gonna have to do what you need to do um, to make them, to give them a specific look when they leave your chair. So after you spray the enhancements, you're just gonna go over it again just to make sure it's clean as possible. Full flag. So right now we're going to get started on this heart shaped um, design that he wanted. So I usually do the straight lines first and then I go into the curves. Um, I don't like my hearts to be like perfectly even. I kind of do it on purpose because it's a design and I wanted to, you know what I'm saying, especially if it's a broken, a broken heart, um, I want it to be kind of deformed just a tad bit. Um, I know some it's not gonna make sense to some of you guys until I'm done and Then you're gonna be like, oh, I can see why he did it that way instead of making it a perfect heart Because I could have made it a perfect heart by going on the other side and making it just as long as the other side Like going to the right side and making a line just as long as the left side before I hit the curves um, But I like it to be off just a tad bit um, For the broken hearts if it was just a heart by itself Then I would have made it like, you know As close to even as possible on both sides but yeah, so basically what you want to do is, the best way I can describe to do 
any design is to put your rough draft in first and then brush it down clean it off and then go again um, do the top line and then do the bottom line uh, i'm using my only my corners when doing this broken heart part right here inside of the heart uh, it's basically just like you go you slice down to the left slash down to the right and then slice back down to the left again um that's really the closest i could get to an uh, actual broken heart you know Right, so right now I'm using my 245 pencil. You can also get this from 245.com. Okay, I got the link in the description below for you guys. Use my discount code, which is already hooked up to the link. So all you gotta do is press that link, um, and it'll give you money off on your purchase. Anything you buy from 245.com. So after you apply this, you just wanna go over it again with the trimmer. Okay, um, spread out that pencil so it doesn't look, you know, too cakey. I know some of you guys are going to be like, why did he get designed if he's a waiver? Listen, this is what he wanted. Um, all I could do is just give him what he wants, you know? So as I said, I'm just using my corners for the whole design. Um, you guys really want to be careful and pay attention to what you're doing because if you're using sharp trimmers, um, like the sharpers I'm using, all it takes is one mess up and that hair is, you know what I'm saying? That hair is gone or a ball spot or the line is too thick thicker than you wanted it to be you know so you make sure you pay attention while you're doing this and use your corners and be real surgical while you're doing it because if you're not paying attention it could all be over so flag as you can see that heart is coming out clean in between the waves and all that so now i'm going to use enhancement just to clean up any areas that i see could be perfected um you know the hair isn't is going to be isn't going to be super dense in certain areas especially once it's cut down to a certain length so i'm just trying to make them areas look a little darker with enhancement detailing this more with the trimmer i'll use my corner only make sure you pay attention to what you're doing pretty much it as far as that part um this is a waivers cut so you want to end off the haircut with the freehand trim as always this is nothing new and this cut is pretty basic it's just a low taper um with the design with the waves he cut down to a two and this is the cut man let me know what you guys think. Let me know if I should do any more design tutorials. Okay, I tried my best to explain how I did the heart <laughs> as best as possible. But yeah, it's your boy FKK, man. My boy definitely trying to look like Drake. You know what I'm saying? We trying to be like Drake. All right, let's just say this design is better than Drake. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, it's your boy FKK, man. I'm just playing around, man. Y'all know how I get. It's your boy FKK. I'm done. I'm done. I'm gone for real this time. Follow me on Instagram at wavykev underscore kev. I'm out. Deuces.